scary. In case you ever catch yourself uh, in the middle of the nowhere. <laughs> That's all I can see. <laughs> see 20 feet in front of me. A warm embracing of the sun through the tree branches, maybe taking a brief moment to admire the art provided by nature, or even the comforting signs of existence in the distance. Gazing ahead at the prolonged road for what seems like countless extended hours, a sense to appreciate all of your surroundings develops. An apprehension that every inch of this land of ours is so beautiful. From the full of life metropolis to the rural countryside roads full of southern hospitality. The inclined mountainous roads to the questionable construction of their unique existence. Each small town holds a culture of its own that fills the gaps of this country with endless stories to tell. The multitude of possibilities that can be experienced while biking over 1,300 miles in three weeks can be voluminous, and your help is needed to continue this story across the country. My name is Jabril Glassani, and I have a goal to find and document inspirational stories of groups of individuals from South Carolina all the way to California. I have recently completed a trip from Wisconsin to South Carolina that included me stopping in several other cities to do some filming and arrests. This made the trip over 1,300 miles, and continuing the trip from South Carolina to California will take some help. At first, I didn't intend to meet generous individuals inspired by just the biking from Wisconsin to South Carolina, but it really only adds to the inspirational aspects of the story. I mean, in addition with the biking to a set destination, only intending to document another story that brings its own inspiration. But some things this picture will consist of are the times and trials of biking long distances. Like what happens when you eat the, too much of the wrong kind of foods, then having to lie down on the side of the road and explain to an officer that you're having a bad introduction to a southern style buffet, or the terrors nature brings. When on the road with no shelter, being blown off the road while being pursued with the thought of being taken away by a tornado. These and others will be the embracing moments that ensue the want to see more. And with $2,400 and some small promotion, this project will be one for the history books. All funds, of course, are for the sole completion of the project. And a complete list of what the funding will go towards specifically will be written out in the dissertation, as well as a list of the nearby towns that will be passed. And if you or anyone you know has a story that should be heard, this is the time to give it a voice. Let's show the beauty and inspiration that's truly all around us.